Okay, in this video I'm just going to talk about power delivery to the camera using a USB power bank. And we've covered this before, so um, I've got a video about which power bank this is and which one I'm using, so I'll link to that up in the corner. But this is specifically because people keep asking me, can the camera be powered from a power bank solely? And again, I did a video about this saying that if you're connecting it to the USB port on the camera, that's not going to work. Um, there's a link up in the corner to the video for a bit more sort of, you know, uh, meaning on, on why that is. But essentially, you can't not have a battery in the camera and just run it from a power bank through USB-C. But people have been quite persistent about <laughs> wanting to use a power bank to power it. So it, there is a way you can do it, but it's not through the USB port. So what you'll need to do is open the battery pack there, take the battery out. So rather than having the standard stock battery and powering it for USB, what we'll actually need is a DCC 17 adapter. And then we can plug that in. And then you can run it out obviously through the through the loop, but I'll just kind of demonstrate this quickly just um, without that. And then we can plug it into our power bank. So I'm using the US, USB PD port on there. So you can see the lights are on, the power's coming out. I've got that on there. This does regulate the power out to the um, to the camera. So um, I'll leave some links to cables and things, but if you're going to buy these, um, number one, make sure it's a DCC 17, so you get the, the right features in the camera. Number two, make sure that it is regulating the voltage to some degree, because otherwise you could send too much power into the camera and cause issues so you know that none of these cables are recommended by Panasonic they would just recommend that you just charge it over USB-C just use internal batteries so obviously this is you know you're doing it at your own risk when you're doing this so it's um, yeah it's not something they they recommend themselves but you can see I can switch on the camera I've actually got SSD recording switched on so I'll just switch that off and then if we come into the Q menu you can actually see because I'm using a um, DCC 17 type battery, I've actually got all the shooting modes there. So, you know, I can do HD, uh, this in PAL, but I can do HD 200 in um, uh, HFR, uh, you know, 4, 4K 100, those kind of modes. So, you can see it's all kind of all there ready to use. So, that is powering the, um, the camera entirely from the power bank there. Um, but it's having to go in through a dummy battery, it's not through the USB-C. So yeah, I just thought I'd kind of go in, explain that, um, and I'll, I'll do another video just about the um, uh, what options you'll get over SSD if you're doing that as well, if it can power one, what options you'll have. But um, yeah, hopefully that's helped. If it has, give the video a like. If you want to see more content like this, then uh, please subscribe and uh, check out the playlist on this channel.